I wasn't saying you guys are ready to go after a night of fun. A lot of fun together. Um, <laughs> I, I knew I was I'm ready to go. Okay, guys, we all just woke up at 7 o'clock. We're heading over to the convention center for our second day at ISTE. Uh, we have our poster session at 8 o'clock, so we have to get there and prepare, set up, maybe get breakfast. I don't really know. <laughs> so, yeah, see you there. Center. Uh, we are setting up our stand. Uh, we just got some scissors. We've got to cut some of the excess plastic. So we're putting together our poster. Um, they're putting together um, all this other nonsense. And yeah, uh, we're just getting ready for our poster session, which starts in 15 minutes. So. Stuff just that we can show it off. We're not, not obviously live streaming this, but uh, it looks cool and we want to draw people in basically. So, yeah, we're almost done setting up. Five minutes to go. We're killing it. to go find some lanyards for us. Let's try and find them. Do you, know, do you yes. know where Riley and Wes went? They went to the student registration center to get us all good lanyards that don't fall off every time you move the lanyard. All right, there they are. I found them, can you see them? They're right there. Did you guys get us some good lanyards? No, actually they only gave them to me and Wes. Sorry. Really? Yes. You're lying. No. <laughs> Ah, oh, she's a liar. <laughs> she Thank has them right you. there. She said she said she gave them to us because we're beautiful. Yes, yeah, she she liked us. She said I'm really not supposed to I give really these out. Don't want to deal for <laughs> what do you think so far, Jaren? Pretty good. Uh, got the updated SCID. We got the uh, lanyard, so bag acquired. Um, a lot better. Don't won't fall off. Finished up the poster session. Went really well. Passed out all our business cards. Talked to a lot of different people. We're gonna walk around and eat a little bit. Have a good time. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to spend like two more days with Riley. She's crazy and she's just so, she, she's too energetic and then she gets sleepy and then she falls asleep on people without even like asking. And then she's like, she's so bossy. Like I can't, I can't, I think I'm gonna have to vote her off the island. I don't know, I don't trust her. I can't trust her anymore. I thought we had a connection. Yeah, so, um. I kind of agree 100% with what Jaren said. Um, she's kind of um, an actually an insane person. Um, she goes from the highest of high to the lowest of low in a matter of two or less seconds. Um, she scares me. I believe she may be psychopathic in nature. And I fear for my life in every moment that I, uh, I'm in her presence. So if I do die, no, it was definitely her. Um, if it seems like an accident, it was even more likely to be her. Um, I also think we should vote her off the island. We're gonna go get breakfast or lunch, doesn't matter. I haven't had food yet today. It's currently um, 11 o'clock. I am a little peckish, a little hungry, just kidding, I'm freaking starving. Um, we're going to Down Home Diner, or maybe Panera Bread, I don't know. We want food, that's all that matters.
everyone here, bro. Like Adobe, uh, Google, Smartboard, uh, Microsoft, Scholastic. Literally, and that's the only one I can see. Go! Uh, that's, that's just what I can see. So we're gonna find some cool places and we're gonna show you guys those cool places. Smartboard. Like, it looks like a tablet on a wall. So, I don't even know what you would like use this for in the classroom, but like, it's like a smartboard, like, tablet type of thing where you've got like, you draw and like. Like, where are you at, East Panama? Catch up. That'll keep going for a few hours. Alright, so we're about to be asked some questions by a uh, middle school news group here. That's the official news group of uh, ISTE, I guess. So, support another. People, boys support boys, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, vlog. That's right. We're <laughs> getting asked questions. My teachers are getting like actual information. Alrighty, so we have upgraded our lanyards. <clears throat> All it took was a slight climb. Fashion vloggers be like, can you see? Can you see? Is it focused? So we've upgraded. I mean, like, you know, it's whatever. We got rid of yeah, the old ones. Flex, we had I these. Mean. These weren't good enough. Catch us next time we update. Yeah, never. This popcorn is disgusting. We're about to watch a movie. We're about to watch a movie. They asked us what makes our school day awesome. I only have one answer. All right, so we just finished up at the expo hall. Um, I'd say we probably got about halfway through, all of us. We split it up, but we got about halfway through, so we might come back tomorrow. Um, got some cool swag. Um, I got engaged. Um, so, shout out to Flo Cab. Uh, Mrs. Martin, this one's for you. Um, uh, we upgraded our lanyards. I heart Flo Cab. I'm really rocking the Flo Cab uh, message right now. But we finished up there. Now we're gonna go do a recap. Uh, as to um, our poster session this morning. An interesting interaction I had today was I was speaking with a gentleman from Pittsburgh and he runs a coding startup company and he wanted to get more into um, promoting his business through video and he talked to us about perhaps having a collaboration in the future. I thought that was pretty cool because you know he wouldn't have known about us unless we were at the poster session. My favorite thing from the poster session was just seeing and hearing from where some of the people were from. The one guy I talked to, was his name was Carlos, who was from Mexico. And while he said his school didn't really have much of a video program, it was just interesting to talk to some people that you, know, you wouldn't think they'd be that from that far away. Uh, we were walking around the expo. Uh, it was me, Riley, and Wes. 
and we saw a computer, it was like a small Microsoft computer tablet thing, but it was where kids could build their own, and so I've built my own computers, and I thought it was really cool that they're prepackaging that and allowing kids to get involved with that pretty early because it's very simple and it's very plug and play. At the expo hall, I really like checking out the uh, the 3D printing booths. Those were those were very nice. They had some cool stuff, some cool filament, some really cool like there was 3D printed fabric that I thought was was pretty amazing. Um, it felt really smooth, so it was it was it was impressive.